Hi guys, this is Sarah from The Savvy Professor. And in today's video, we're going to talk about the symptoms of a high AC low side pressure. The air conditioning, otherwise called the AC system, is used to provide a cooler environment within a car in hot weather. Think of it as a fan used to cool the interior of a house during hot days. High AC low side pressure means that the system is unable to produce the right temperature to cool down the car. Therefore, the interior temperature of the car rises, increasing pressure in the evaporator. It also becomes uncomfortable for the occupants, especially on sunny days. Think of this as switching on the heater in the house on sunny days. So, what are the dangers of a high AC low side pressure? The compressor gets more damaged. Since high AC low side pressure could be because of overcharge, it could lead to more damage to the compressor. The evaporator starts to leak. The energy in the compressor may cause the pressure in the car to be excessive, leading to the evaporator bursting. It can affect human health. If the occupants in the car spend a lot of time in the car with this problem, it could lead to excessive sweating, which can cause dehydration. Now, what are the common symptoms to look out for? High temperature reading. You may notice that the temperature gaze readings are too high, even when the AC is on. The AC is not cooling the car even after you turn it on. A hissing sound coming from the AC system. Due to leakage from the refrigerant, a hissing sound is heard from the AC system. To sum up, here's a quick tip on how to fix the issue. To fix high AC low side pressure, you need to release pressure from it. However, it's recommended to have a professional mechanic fix this problem, because any wrong action while releasing the pressure could lead to more damage to the AC system. Thanks for watching.